Hello everyone, today I'm here for CC Design and I got the superhero set and I did something with her last time and now I'm going to do with the Superman. Love this set, they're so cute. And also I used some 12 by 12 paper from the hero kit and I used that yellow one that I pointed to first and yeah. So here is my card base. It's four and a half by six and a half and I'll put a little strip of paper inside to match the outside. And that's doodlebug paper. It has a nice shine, it has some gold on there but I'm not using that side, I'll be using the blue because it matches my letters that I made. So there, I'm just gonna put a little bit of glue to hold it down, it's much easier to work that way. And here's the panel that down and that will cover the whole uh, card base and yeah so a fun and easy card for today there you go and here is a white panel and I'm just gonna glue that down that's gonna frame my like scene that I made and I did that off camera because I'm using the same ideas as I did on the other previous videos. So you can go look at the green lantern. I have the same letters. So I built them up with three layers of white with the pattern paper on top. So that's four layers on top. So, and I, and I use the same buildings in my flash card. So you can go check that out also in here. So they're glossy because I put some glossy accent on there. Like I said, I, you can go watch the video. It shows you exactly how I did those. And I'm just gonna layer that down. The white is gonna frame it up. So there's my Superman and pop him up. Just adding some dimension on the side so it is the same level everywhere. And I'll show you how to color him in a bit. There. I'm going to add some nice little stars and I'll put them red so it all blends all together because it needed some red. And I'm just playing with them, putting them all around, see where I should put them. So if you haven't seen the superheroes, they are back in stock because last time I did a video, they were all sold out. They are back in stock. So yes, so that's at CC Design and you can get these cuties. And if you don't want to miss the new release, because that's coming up soon, um, just subscribe to this channel and you'll see all the updated videos for CC Design. Here I'm popping some of those stars up and the smaller ones, I'm going to just glue them directly down. And I'm even putting one on the A. Find that little stars add so much to this, this card. And one more on the building here. There, all done. With the building, I did pop the second layer, the black layer, um, up. So there's dimension there. So I'm just adding a little bit of of the stars inside too. There you go. All done. And I'm going to show you how I colored the Superman. There you go. And I start with the E00. Should put my glasses on because I can't see that great. E13, these are the basic colors I usually use. And 
I'll bring in the E11 in a second. Yeah, for this one, I didn't ask my son. I just did what I wanted to do. I'm a big super um, man fan. When I was a kid, I used to watch the, the series. I think it was in, I think, uh, early 90s or is it late 80s? I don't know. But yeah, here I'm blending all three together now. I should have put the dark shade on the nose on top instead of inside the nose, but it's fine. It'll all blend in. So of course I'll be bringing some pencil at the end here to help with the shading. As I said, there's a few videos that I made. If you want to go check those out, if you missed the superhero uh, videos, I did the Green Lantern, uh, Aquaman, Flash, the Joker and his girlfriend, um, and Wonder Woman last time. That was a cute one too. So yeah. So now I'm going to start the hair and I'm going in with a C2 because I want him to have black hair. So I'm going to put one layer of this one and leave it for a bit and go with the red. So they are 17 for the lighter shade. that little piece and I'm bringing in the 27 so the R27 for the darker shade so basically going to the same place that I did with the lighter and putting a layer of the darker one And now I have the lighter and I'm just going to pull those two together and blend. When I touch the nib of the darker one, it's just to help it to blend. And if you're new to this channel, I always use the 80 pound Nina white solar paper for the uh, for to color on all my stamping is on that so I haven't received my new uh, release for next month but it should be in any day so I'll be starting the new release for CC pretty soon. They're cute and I can't even give you a hint. Sorry. <laughs> so I'm just doing the bo boots the same color here. And if you get these little superheroes, you could always Google and look at their colors that they have because sometimes we we like them but we don't remember exactly how they should be right so i googled it and looked how superman should be and i seen that his little boots and then he has like these little underwears <laughs> on top of his pants so i kind of put some the look of that it doesn't really have the lines for it so you just have to create yourself or you can even skip that if you don't want to do that but I like to have it cl as close as it can be so here I got the B16 and I was gonna have two different colors like to blend together but my 14 I guess is in a pile that's dried up or needs refill so I, I need to buy more markers. 
So all I did here is I'm going to do two layers of that same blue and do, like I said, the um, shading with the pencil at the end. So here is a darker shade for the hair. So the C7. And I do go around a few times with that so it makes it a little darker. So you'll see me go through it a few times. See that's the second layer here. And I'll add a little bit of black pencil at the end also. I'm just going like I said a few times on the same spot just to darken it up fussing with it that's the proper thing fussing okay so there is the Y uh, R 23 and that's for the big S the belt and the trim on his boot and the sole And I go on that twice also. And here at the C4 for a lighter shade on the hair. And again, I'll bring in the C7 to do a couple layers again. Yeah, I'm fussing here. Until I'm happy with it, right? And that's the C4 again. So here is the pencil. So we're starting the pencil and that is for the skin color. So two pencils, that's it for today. So for the skin and I'll be bringing in the black for everything else. So easy peasy. And here's my nib and Gamsol to blend the pencil in. looking good and here it's the black like I said I'm gonna do that on everything else so on the cape on the little suit in his hair the boots everything And I'll, oh, I had forgot that part. So I'm gonna blend that in now. And if you like my videos, you can always give it a thumbs up. I always appreciate it and it helps other people to see my video. So, yeah. So, 
just still blending. I find just adding that black is adding so much to the image. And now I'm going to do the hair. And I'll blend that in. You're not pulling the black too, too much because you don't want to close it all in. You want that highlight of the lighter black. So, yes. So now I'm just playing with the eyes and I got, I'm not sure, it probably the same color I used uh, for this suit. So there is my Superman. Super cute. And here is the material again. I did not put the, the star uh, that I used. But I, like I said, they're all on the other videos. I'm showing all those same materials. So hope you like my card and I'll see you all very soon. Bye.